So for a detailed site plan, we want to do the same type of thing, but this time we want to zoom in a lot more. So we want to be a lot closer to the point where we can only see the site and maybe a couple of neighbors around the site would be sufficient. Again, the good thing about six maps is it is quite detailed, so we can see fairly high resolution. If we're happy with that, then again, we'll do another screenshot. Now I could do this in Photoshop if I wanted to edit it. If I don't really care about editing it, I can go straight into Archicad. I'll make a new worksheet, new independent worksheet. We'll call this one Detailed Site Photo and drag and drop. Drag and drop this into our plan. How do we resize? We select the image, we go to our resize function, edit, reshape resize. We want to define graphically, so we make sure that's ticked, and if it's ticked we press OK. We now zoom in, so we need to find a reference for resizing. Now, it's hard to see here, but that says 0, 15 meters, 30 meters. So I'm going to zoom in and click on the end of the graphic scale, click on the other end of the graphic scale, and type in 30 meters. Now that's going to get, get us ish close. We can actually do better than that because we know exactly what the boundary should look like. So we can go up to our upper ground floor. We can copy that information. Copy the boundary. Just turn off trace reference for a second. And then go to our detailed site photo and paste that site boundary. Now we want to move this photo into place. So right click, move, drag. I'm going to find a particular point this time, so I'm going to click on this corner, click on the same corresponding corner, and then I'll rotate, edit, move, rotate, rotate the photo up into the same orientation. And then I can do whatever I need to with this image. I can again use this image as a saved image or and use that in my drawings. Or I can trace over this to trace the positioning of the neighbors, of the streets, of the trees, whatever else I need to do. So let's just save this as a new save view. Detailed site photo. What scale do I want? It's probably going to be more like 1 to 200 or 1 to 500 for this particular one. How much do I want to see? I want to see a neighbor on either side. So two different plans, basically the same process. The larger the scale that we use, the easier it is to get that site looking correct.